Hey, what's up guys? It's Big Marv here, and I just wanted to shoot a quick video showing you guys how to use uh, subdomains or custom domains to redirect your affiliate links if you have ClickFunnels. So if you use ClickFunnels, um, you're going to need some kind of email server program like MailChimp or AWeber, ActiveCampaign, Stingray, whatever you decide to use. Um, you're going to have to use your affiliate links because... Russell Brunson, for example, gives you a 27-day email swipe so you can promote all the different offerings that ClickFunnels and, you know, Russell Brunson offers in the Edison suite, such as, you know, Funnel University and um, Pro Tools and the Expert Seekers books and Dotcom Seekers, all, all, all the different affiliate things that you can potentially make income on with ClickFunnels. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that real quick. So here is the back end right here. So if you if you go into your ClickFunnels account and you go to affiliate, the, it basically brings you to this screen. So once you go to this screen, this is how you get your link. So say you wanted to build a funnel around the freeplusshipping.com secrets book. All right, so you just click the get my links. And now you can see here's your affiliate link. This is the default link. If you want a specific link to a specific page, so we have the book here, and then it will just pop it up here. So you can turn off the pop-ups, you can turn on the cookie preview. However you want to generate your link, this is how you generate your link. Okay, so here, here's the link here. So say I wanted, you know, DCS book. So we go into my server. So I use cPanel. So um, cPanel is a really common shared server type. You might have... G Suite might have anything else, but the key here is what I'm doing with DNS. Um, so it, it might look a little different, but just take the technology tidbits with you. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create a subdomain. All right, so we'll go DCS book. So DCS book dot Marvin's World dot US. Let me find my domain. So many domains. Marvinsworld.us. All right, cool. And then I'm gonna dump it into, uh, you know, like a, a folder just so I know, like this is my affiliate links. So I'm gonna say affiliate. And so the root folder of this subdomain is gonna be there. That's not really important. This is just where the physical folder is gonna be on the server. I'm gonna create that. All right, cool. So that's been created. So once you create that, you can go back to the home page. Now we're going to go into the zone editor and create a record for our, sorry, not a zone, the zone editor, sorry. We're going to go to forwarders or redirects. So you go to redirect. So there's going to be a permanent redirect, not all my domains, just the one I just created. So we created dcsbook.marvinsworld.us and it's going to redirect to, you guess it, your affiliate link. and then add all right so just to test this out let's open a new incognito window so here's my affiliate link that I just pasted in there you can see it goes here all right so now let's open another tab this is still incognito and we'll go to DCS book dot Marvin's world dot us and it should redirect boom right there to the right place so the reason you want to do this is so in your MailChimp and all your other campaigns and everything else, you have this this friendly domain, dcsbook.marvinsworld.us. And then, you know, this gets you past um, advertising. Like, you know, when you're trying to promote something, you don't want to put that big-ass ugly affiliate link. Boom, now you just have this really simple, good advertising link. That is amazing. And if you if you don't want to do, you know, subdomains, like it, it's easier to do a subdomain, like if you have one thing, like I'm Marvin's World, so I'm going to have several domains, Marvin's, you know, it's not that far-fetched to have a subdomain. But if you have the capital, you can just purchase a domain and go into the server and create a redirect at the WW level. So you can see here, musicsites.com, 
is one of my domains. So if I did a permanent musicsites.com and redirected it, then that would redirect all root traffic from that domain straight to that URL. So what you can do is you can just buy a domain from GoDaddy or wherever and turn the forwarding on and just set it to forward to your affiliate link, which is you know something else that you can do. But that that's up to you and how you want to do it. Um, subdomains or a full root level domain, they will both work in this case. Um, this is Big Marv. I hope it was helpful. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for all the love and support. Don't forget to like and share. Check out the Big Marv page on Facebook. Give me a like and a follow. One love, guys. Take it easy. And good luck, funnel hacking out there.